and welcome, this is Baller Scuba with Let's Play Tales of Fantasia. We're going to be playing the PlayStation 1 version of the game, which is why we got that opening cinematic. Uh, this originally came out for the Super Famicom in 1994, just in Japan. Uh, this is the 1998 re-release of the game. It was released for the PlayStation 1, like I said, uh, thanks to a fan translation done in 2012, we are able to play the game because I can't read or understand Japanese, so the only way that this is happening is with a fan translation. Uh, there are later versions of the game, but this is the one that we are going to be doing. Uh, if you're playing a different version of the game, your experiences may vary, sometimes greatly, sometimes even when it comes to plot, but the PlayStation 1 version is the one uh, that is considered canon moving forward in the Tales series, so this is the one that I felt was best. So, let's press button and head into the game. Uh, we do have the option to customize things, uh, but I don't think I necessarily need to take care of too much. Maybe increase the message speed a little bit, uh, but outside of that, we are good. We're going to leave the uh, the art names pretty much the same. Uh, the uh, sprite seems good for the menu character display. Uh, we could do portrait. Maybe we'll change that later. We're going to leave the battle rank on as is. Uh, but everything else looks good. So let's start ourselves a new game. Let's play Tales of Fantasia. I should mention before we actually get underway, though, that this game has voice acting, which is rare for the PlayStation 1. However, the voice acting is done in Japanese. There will be English subtitles, but the voice acting itself will all be in Japanese. There are going to be times when I can just go ahead and say what was said in Japanese and English, uh, but in certain cases, I won't have time to say what was said in Japanese. So if you're not necessarily fluent in Japanese or not following along, I'll try to summarize what happened in the cutscene if it's all in Japanese. That's the way that we're going to go through this. Let's get into the game. Let's play Tales of Fantasia. Our character's name is going to be Kles. We're going to name all the characters uh, essentially their default names. Uh, there's a little bit of controversy whether it's Kles or Kress, uh, because, of course, it is the liquid consonant in Japanese that sometimes sounds like an L, sometimes sounds like an R, and is almost unpronounceable by Western speakers like me. So we're going to stick with Kles because that's the default and that seems to be the one that sticks. So we're going to stick with Kles Alvin. Let's go with that. Let's head into the game. We have a cutscene ahead of us, as I'm sure you might imagine. Tenkou mitsuru tokoro ni ware wa ari. Yomi no mon ni hiraku tokoro ni nanji ya. Ide kan no mi tanashi. Nani? Sore wa? Kore de sayou da! Indignation!
貴様なぜここにやめろこれで私の家に代々続いた使命も終わりか。そして十数年の月日が流れた And we get to take over as our main character. We are class now. こんにちはトリスタン師匠 I'll get to what he said in just a second, but he did say Tristan.、Uh, so, what happened in that cutscene? At least what it appeared to me is that we saw some people defeat this other guy. Like it was four on one, it seemed. And then they sealed him in a coffin. And it seemed like there were two necklaces or something like that that seemed to be important in that. Most of what we saw were opening cutscenes. Or, sorry, opening credits, which is not something that you see a lot in video games, but they wanted to give the voice actors their due. So we got to see who voiced them before we actually got into the game. All right, so. We're taking over as classes. Seemingly, people are practicing their swordsmanship around here. That must mean I'm a swordsman, too. Oh, good afternoon, Master Tristan. This is a surprise. It's been a while. Oh, hello, class. Has it been that long already? At my age, it becomes hard to tell. Then we have Class's father, Miguel. Another father named Miguel, huh? That sounds familiar. Class. What is it, Dad? No, wait, was it the father? No, it was the father's friend. Never mind. How's your mother doing? Getting better? She's not burning up anymore, so I think she'll be as good as new pretty soon.、Mm. So, anyway, I called you down here to speak with you about your pendant. My, my pendant? Oh. Ah,、oh, you mean the one that you gave me for my 15th birthday? You just want to say it out in public out here? I remember you saying it was important that I keep it safe, which is what makes it all the more strange that you want to talk about in front of your class here. Why was that? Oh, we get to scene change here. Wow, apparently he said a lot.、Uh, this is Chester. All right, I'm, gonna, I'm going off to hunt us some dinner. And that's. I'm going to go with Ami because it sounds French and then it's not Amy, which would be spelled differently. This is Ami. Don't get hurt out there. Watch for angry boars. Yeah, and you watch the pad until I come back. Oh, hold on, big brother. Would you tell Kles that I have a little surprise for him? Anything for little sis. Well, see you later. And he just heads straight up, so we're neighbors.、Oi. Hey, class! Let's go, dude! I don't know how you translate dude into Japanese, but apparently it works the other way. Is that Chester I hear? Oh, that's right. Sorry, Dad. Chester and I planned to hang out today. Well, in that case, we'll resume our talk over dinner instead. Okay, thanks, Dad. Master Tristan, please make yourself at home. And off I shamble. Sorry about the wait. Nah, it's all good. Anyway, did you guys invite the circus over? So loud from out here, you'd think everyone in there is after each other's necks or something. Actually, Master came by. The Master? Oh, you mean that old guy, Tristan? He hardly looks like he can hold a sword, doesn't he? I heard he gave my dad some tough lessons way back in his instructor days, and. Class! Huh? Mom? You shouldn't come out here until you're better. Class's mother, Maria! I know, but I'm more concerned about you two. 
I don't want to see you boys come home wounded, so be careful. We know. Chester will have his bow, and I'll have my sword. We can handle this. Yeah, no need to be worried about us, ma'am. We're just gonna go hunt in the woods like usual. We'll bring back enough game to feed everyone for a month. Sounds good, but... Don't go overboard, you hear? And take these with you, just in case you run into unexpected trouble. And we get two apple gels. They're called apple gels in this game. Uh, other games I know call them gummies, apple gummies. Uh, either way, they function the same way in the game, no matter how uh, your translation translates it. Well, looks like we're done here. Yeah, let's do it. Oh, hold on a sec, I almost forgot. Ami said she has a little surprise waiting for you.